This housing market is creating some problems, <laughs> but for who? I want to share with you a quick perspective on both a boom and a bust housing market. You see, every one of us likes to take a very logical, prudent approach when it comes to buying or selling their home. Uh, now, it's understandable because it's a huge purchase and there are a lot of things to consider. But when it comes to real estate, in general, many people just treat it differently than uh, any other big purchase. For instance, we witnessed over the last eight or nine years a very heavy boom toward runaway housing prices. Now, every stakeholder involved couldn't justify the values of the homes and the appreciation rate. <clears throat> However, everybody went along with it. And we're all just seeing how is this going to play out? Logically, we all said the fundamentals didn't make any sense, but that is what happens in real estate. Now, I'm not saying we're in a bust. However, here's what happens when we are. We see homes start to take a longer time to sell. Home prices start to decrease, incentives start to be being offered to buy a home, etc. Now, here's the paradox. When the housing market gets a little soft, home buyers back away. But when home prices are soaring, buyers jump in. <laughs> it's a weird paradox and it's just weird. Now, it is comparable to the day after Thanksgiving, Black Friday. Many of us know that many retail stores, everybody runs into the stores when there are sales and big savings. Imagine if the store manager announced over the intercom, we have more inventory in back that we're gonna be bringing out and we're gonna reduce some prices. Would that make everybody excited and stay or would they all run out the door? Well, in real estate, they all run out the door. It's just crazy. My main point is this, buying or selling your primary residence should be done when it makes sense for you and your family's needs. When your finances and life say it's time. At that moment, it doesn't matter what is happening in the marketplace, you can navigate through it and meet what you're trying to accomplish. You see, the most important thing at that time is this. What's your game plan? I started out by saying that this real estate market is creating problems. Well, the biggest problem it creates is it puts people in a frozen state. It puts you in a, we're going to wait and see what happens mode. I understand the concerns. I understand the concerns with the unknown. However, if you gain some clarity on what you want your housing to look like, create a plan, what are the hurdles for you specifically, and just keep refining it, things will become noticeably clear. That's not only a good feeling, it's something you can run with. <laughs> Until we meet, you take care.